Essex is America's antique capital, and since the 1930s, Essex and antiques have been intertwined so that today our village boasts of over 20 shops that cater to the curious seekers, the first-time buyers, and the collectors. Antique dealers are the guardians of history, and for people to be able to experience that, there's, it, it gives us pleasure. It's what we do, um, and that's why we're antique dealers. The shops have an eclectic sort of array of different antiques. The variety is incredible from, you could say, doorknobs to incredible artwork to wonderful uh, period furniture that are heirloom pieces. One of the wonderful things about antique shops are that they are an opportunity to really infuse where you live and how you live with character and with history and with beauty in a way that's not reproducible elsewhere. Some people don't realize there are things that are two or three hundred years old that are still functional and beautiful and, and are made to last for another four or five hundred years. And the beautiful thing about shopping here rather than at the mall is that when you come here every single piece in each shop is unique. Don't buy things because people have told you it's a good investment or it's a bad investment or it's what's trendy now or it's going to be trendy in the future. Once you see a piece that hits your heart and hits your soul, that's the antique experience. For somebody young who who's just wants to kind of make their mark and show who they are and go on an intellectual and aesthetic journey, I mean, antique shops can do that. People, you know, they love coming and seeing something that they never saw before. And it's all fresh stuff. And it's not, it hasn't been in another shop, it hasn't been in an auction. It's been hidden in somebody's house or garage or barn. There are actually treasures here. That's also the fun of it all. It's a constant treasure hunt, but it's a learning experience. So when you come in and you see something, ask about it, learn about it, do your own research. To me, that's, that's the joy of shopping. And that's what I think a lot of people are missing when they try to buy everything online. You, you have to get out and really experience things, and it really is a joy. I just think the variety of objects, the individuality of the owners and their tastes, um, and they're just the charm and the natural beauty of the town. I mean, it's just really, really beautiful to take a stroll down the street and see these beautiful marshes, and there's good food, and then all these shops to kind of explore. The experience is something that we give to people, and we will never let that go. And it's just always going to be a place for antiquing. Thank you.